What is up guys? We are back on the road. Yet again, I'm bringing you another a vlog here in the Arson Brothers vlog series. At the traditional Arson Brothers meeting spot we in are. Bristol, Virginia, the Golden Corral. That's right. You see back there, lots of infamy with uh, the Arson Brothers in this spot, for sure. But of course, I'm A.B. Matt Klein. A.B. Size. A.B. Scott. And we are on the road to, well, as you heard, in Bristol, Virginia, but on the road to Asheville, North Carolina, uh, going in to the city for a weekend for what we're we going for guys for a, a good looking tour a yeah. good looking tour indeed which is of course Sturgill Simpson and Tyler Childers the concert that'll be actually Sunday night which will be as we're filming this tomorrow yeah. night yeah but we're going down tonight going to make some stops along the way and just going to really try to take in Asheville and bring you along with it as much as we can show you it's going to be fun Hey, we're at Backdoor Records in Johnson City, Tennessee, making a little stop on the way to Asheville. It's gonna be a good looking tour. We'll go here and see what kind of cool stuff we can find. Scott's already in there, so go join him here in a second. We have arrived in Asheville, in West Asheville, actually right. right now, at our home for the next two days, the Country Inns and Suites. On Haywood Road. Yeah, mm -hmm. so thank them for putting up with the ABs. Yeah. <laughs> but it's like a nice establishment here. We're in a little veranda, a little area, chilling. Thought we'd peek around. Already uh, dined upon some cookies, furnished yeah. by the motel. A little, a little coffee. on the entrance here. So we're rolling, we're gonna get uh, get our wits about us, get freshened up, and hit the downtown scene here in a bit and see what happens. It's gonna be a good night. All right. <laughs> we got a Jerry snuck in this time. Oh <laughs> yeah, we got another one here with us. He's just been hiding, but we are in downtown Asheville, right near a, a favorite venue of ours. Where are we near, son? Uh, we're right down the road from the Orange Field. We're next to the big loft hotel there. Super nice, fancy place behind oh, us. Oh yeah. But we're about to go exploring, you know how we do, see what we can find, and we'll check in as we go. Hey! <laughs> hey, we have stopped here at the Orange Peel in Asheville. Um, the show we're going to is not here, unfortunately, but this is the home of the very first Arshon Brothers uh, Asheville road trip. Um, we came out here and saw the drive-by truckers in 2015, two nights yeah. at the Orange Peel. So Hopefully a return trip for that. Yeah, uh, yeah, I hope to be back soon for that. So we just want to make a little uh, return pilgrimage to the, uh, the home of the original a B road trip. That's right. Yeah, great venue if you're ever in Asheville, yeah. check that out. Always, even tonight, there's always good music there. I know the phone. I got my heater right here. All right, we've made it to the Asheville Pinball Museum. Yeah, one of my favorite places in the city of Asheville. Yeah, uh, he's been here before. Cold beers and fun games inside. At fifteen dollars for the whole day. What more? What more can you ask for, really? So we're gonna check it out, see what we can take in, have some fun. We'll bring you. All right, we're kicking it here in the Pinball Museum. Lots of fun, man. I just jammed out on some 1966-style Batman. Pinball, uh, a Konami game that I've never played before, and right now so I was jamming up some Pac-Man. But um, I think there's a Tetris machine over here. A Tetris machine? Yeah. Oh man. You can see around just this one room of many. Oh, yeah. See behind us the famous. It's backwards to you, but the Dragon's yeah. Lair machine. Uh, and, and made famous yet again by, by Stranger Things. Yeah. yeah. The, the guys played it in the arcade in the mall. Court. So, you know we gotta check this thing out. We just had a rousing game, uh, Area 51, yeah, hard, Area pretty 51. deep. So, let's get in this but thing. But this right here, it says um, only 200 are still working in America. 
Oh, wow. That's so, amazing. Yeah, That's really cool. Dragon's Lair was very hard for me. I made it past the first little movement, literally. But we just had a great battle. Me and a, our son cousin Jerry here on Street What's Fighter 2. Who won? He won. He whooped me. He whooped me bad. First but. time I ever played. How'd that go? I am no Billy Mitchell or Steve Levy. <laughs> That's <laughs> good. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard. 1975. Actual Tommy Pinball from the movie. Uh, it's right on 40,000 points. This is cool. Only uh, 10,000 producers ever. Yeah. Awesome. That awesome brother sure plays me pinball. Oh. Alright. Strikes and spares. 1977, only 12,000 ever produced. I'm, I'm, I'm having a rough game. I'm throwing all strike, all spare, all gutter balls. No strikes, no spare. That's what I meant to say. It's hard work. It's cold. Very that 70s show ish. It is. Love. It's a little fizz biz. So let's break into the fizz biz classic. I had right here, as you can see, uh, a generic wrestling game. Who, who are we going with? Matterson Decker. That looks good. Check this out. Is Madison Decker the big show? Is Madison Decker the big show? What? No. Is this is the WWF WrestleMania or is it like a... I think so. Even the bathroom here at the Pinball Museum is cool. Look at all these figures. Classic Marvel figures lining the tops here. Posters everywhere. Even some uh, classic pinball boards and a uh, Parts of a machine here, and some classic print marble curtains, just signs, posters, everywhere. Kind of Star Wars here, and look right here. I'll show you the urinal. I'm not afraid. Oh, stay on target. And sat back here in the back is just classic consoles. You can see got NES in my hand, about to jam some Mario Brothers. Right here, Super Super Nintendo F Zero. Scott over there working on some Tetris. There's a uh, Genesis in the corner with Sonic rolling. No, we're going to get some wrestle fest in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. My man, 
Daddy Hoge. Yeah, yeah that's like, right. That's a good friend right there. <laughs> This is the oldest machine they have here from 1937 and uh, it's not currently active and the uh, oldest active machine they have here from 1971 Challenger it is actually a dual player game so you play against each other that's the, um, the oldest playable game here in the Asheville Pinball Museum Hey, we just left the Pinball <laughs> Museum, and the cool thing about it is it's right across the street from Harris, yeah. um, formerly the uh, U.S. Cellular Center, and with that's where tomorrow night that we will be seeing uh, Sturgill and Tyler, and tonight they're playing for the first night. This night sold out before we get tickets, but we've been seeing people going in and out all oh, night. Yeah. It's a packed crowd. Looks like a lot of people excited about uh, the good-looking tour here in Nashville. That's right, and we are too. Tomorrow right. night we'll be back right here. We want to show. The, uh, pictures, but we have nothing well, it was, it was like you said, we're at uh, Farm Burger here in Asheville, and we were so excited that we forgot to come on and actually show you the food. But uh, absolutely fantastic burger, like, like way on point, fresh local raised beef, and just excellent. So, you know, we had to get our meal in for the evening and we found a good spot so if you're ever down this way definitely check out farm burger we recommend it get some pimento cheese fries yeah you got the pimento cheese fries you got it's got kind of like garlic looking garlic cheese kind of fries yeah. all right we've made it uh down to fletcher north carolina now because we found you know us smiley's flea market man this place looks huge it looks awesome there's just little shops everywhere, tables, people selling. We're gonna see what kind of treasures we can find. We parked in front of a TARDIS. This old man's been talking weirdly yeah, to he's, us. He's it's, been working us already. It's, it's, it's exactly what you want. So we're gonna see what we can find here at uh, Smiley Sweet Market. All right, we are in the field, as it's referred to here by the uh, locals, the um, outside area of the flea market, which it is. February, so it's probably not as bumping as much as it will be in like three or four months. No, there's quite a few people. Yeah. Let's see the carousel here behind us. Uh, One dollar ride, two dollar all day, three dollars all weekend. Heck of a deal for a carousel lover. Yeah, it really is. And they're three dollars for all weekend. That's forty-eight hours of carousel run. All right, we're wrapping up here at the big flea market. Yep. Successful day, man. Yeah, we oh, some yeah. Records and Jerry got a driver. Yeah. We got some, uh, I got some NASCAR memorabilia. memorabilia. We, we did well. A uh, fine place for down this way if you're like us and like to get out uh, exploring and hunting for things. Definitely recommend it. So, it's awesome. All right. We're at Goodwill and there's a line to get in. <laughs> First time in my life. Yeah, well, oh, oh the doors are open. We got to run. Yeah. They're lined up here. We're here for opening at the fanciest Goodwill store I've ever encountered. And there's an Atlas in there, but we're behind now. We gotta go. All right, finished up in the Goodwill. Not a lot of fine size pounds in my music yeah, DVDs. Music Justin Timberlake, the Cimbrists, uh, some random Southern rap group. Nice. I'm not there, the Bob Dylan movies. Yeah, love that one. But uh, cool experience here at this nice Goodwill. Uh, we checked out the retail and the outlet. It is packed out, place to be. All right, now we headed over to Rocky's Hot Chicken Shack. This place looks awesome. You can sort of see the sign there. We'll get a better shot for you, but man, this place looks cool. It said on the sign, one of the top 20 fried chicken spots in the country, uh, ranked by USA Today, so this should be fun. Giant chicken breast here. The Rockies hot chicken. Spicy, delicious. We had some deviled egg dip right there. Chicken with the sandwich. It was good. Yeah, it's really good. Chicken thighs are good. All right, we're in line. Yeah, 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 we're in
lined yeah. up. Lined up you can see it behind, behind us. You can see it in front of us. There's the venue. Ready to go. Tyler Childers, Sturgill Simpson. A good looking tour tonight. We are pumped, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, extremely excited. Uh, good vibe in the air here. So we'll, we'll bring you as much as we can when we get in here. It, it, yeah. All right. Out on the uh, deck here at the Harris Center. 20 minutes till show time. Yeah, man. We're. We are ready. Uh, the mood is good here in the center, the uh, Harris Center. Pump Scotts just picked up some awesome yeah, merch. Crazy good merch. Got an awesome poster. Vinyl? Is it right here? Yeah, it's right oh, well, look at that. Right here, he's going to show it off. And by a uh, local artist Astral here. Artist? Yeah, actually. Maybe uh, that that actually hurt it. There we go. But yeah, and picked up a couple shirts, a vinyl. We're ready to rock. About to head to our seats, and we'll bring you what we can.
until super late last night yeah. and oh, our minds were basically blown away. Religious experience really. Yeah, yeah. man, fantastic show. Um, Tyler Children said oh, fantastic as well, but the Sturgill just, uh, I, I don't I don't have a lot of words yeah. even, but, but we're back, we're already on the road, we're back to uh, where we started at with you guys at Bristol. Bristol. You see the Golden Corral behind us there. Science is about to depart from us. Mosey on his way. We've lost Jerry for the time being, but yeah. he, he's still with us. He's had a good trip as well, I do believe. He went to pee and then like 
randomly went to another restaurant. So yeah. I don't know if they're just shutting it down. <laughs> I guess the pay, like, no, not here. Killing it. We're yeah. seen walking around. Or he wanted a milkshake. That's the two yeah. leading theories, you know. But it's been an awesome trip. Hope you've enjoyed what we brought you. Hope you enjoyed that show footage. And Ash will definitely go there. We'll, we'll go back as soon as we can. Yeah. And stay tuned to everything here on Arson Brothers Network and Arson Brothers Entertainment on Facebook. Instagram as well. Check us out. Check out our podcast, all of our projects. Please like, share, subscribe. Thank you.